Today, June 30, 2021, a number of 347 repatriates will fly by a DFA special chartered flight. This is the third chartered flight this month specially mounted by the Department for UAE-based Filipinos. The next schedule of repatriation by a DFA special chartered flight is expected next month July 17, 2021 with some 350 passengers. Another repatriation flight is expected on July 5 arranged by LMA or local manning agency, and on July 10 managed by AWA. All passengers of DFA repatriation flights are required to undergo RT-PCR test 48 hours before the flight. We will have more flights in the coming days. A DFA team visits quarantine hotels to give the 10,000 pesos reintegration assistance for DFA repatriates who did not get it in Naaya or Ninoy Aquino International Airport. We know that due to travel restrictions many Filipinos are stranded in various parts of the world. For stranded Filipinos, who needs assistance? You may communicate with this contact details. DFA. More than 1.9k Filipinos repatriated from UAE this June the Department of Foreign Affairs through the Office of the Undersecretary for Migrant Workers Affairs OUMWA confirms that some 1,920 overseas Filipinos were part of the repatriation efforts from the United Arab Emirates just this month of June 2021. The figure includes the 347 distressed overseas Filipinos leaving Dubai tomorrow, the 30th of June, via a DFA special chartered flight. This is the third chartered flight this month specially mounted by the Department for UAE-based Filipinos. All passengers of DFA repatriation flights are required to undergo RT-PCR test 48 hours before the flight. The Duterte government continues to help our Kababayans who are stranded or distressed in the UAE. We have and we will continue mounting chartered flights until we have successfully repatriated those in need, assured Undersecretary Sarah Lou Ariola. The DFA has previously mounted special flights for stranded Filipinos in the UAE. Last the 2nd of June. The Cebu Pacific 5J11 brought home 364 land-based OFWs. The department chartered PAL PR8659 flight last the 17th of June, on the other hand, repatriated 322, all but one land-based workers. The DFA also expressed its appreciation of the efforts local manning agencies LMAs, in helping organize the repatriation of sea-based workers. Three, three LMA arranged flights arrived from the UAE this month. The flights that arrived last 14, 24, and the 28th of June brought home 289, 310, and 287, respectively, or a total of 886 seafarers. We wish to assure our distressed Kababayans in the UAE that we are not only firming up plans but executing these plans accordingly to bring them home the soonest possible in accordance with the instructions of the President, added Undersecretary Ariola. In the month of July, a DFA chartered flight with some 350 passengers is expected on the 17th. An LMA flight is expected on the 5th, and another by OWWA on the 10th. We will have more flights in the coming days, concluded the Undersecretary.